Hello everybody, it's Sephiroth Soul 4 for another episode of Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. In the last episode, we entered the Pirate's Grotto, and there was some mysterious voice warning us away. I wonder if it's the ghost of Tutan Koopa from the last game. Spoilers, it's not. But, um... Oh god! Um, uh, who do I want against these guys? Uh, yeah, Goombell is probably best just because she can jump on them. I feel like I'm not using Flurry enough, and that makes me sad. But I did use Flurry enough, uh, a, a bunch, back in the old days. Anyway, let's just beat this guy. I already started talking, so it's gonna be it for the... Why does it seem louder than it was? I'm recording, right? Yes, okay. At least we're getting a decent amount of star points from these enemies, too. Uh, you know what? You know who I'm gonna switch you with, actually? Uh, Boko would actually be fantastic for this. In between Gulp going through defense and Ground Pound just doing a bu whole bunch of damage uh, after they're flipped over, Boko is, was pretty good for that. Also in this room, Star Piece! Oh, more spikes, hooray. Uh, can... Can we get this with Koops, too? Wow, that's... So far, um, Koops has been pretty useful today, so congrats, dude. Uh, let's... where's... Did I not? Okay, I thought I pressed left right away, but I guess I didn't. Oh, <laughs> you know what I have to do? I forgot I could turn into a tube already. <laughs> As you can see, there are areas that jet out at the bottom, so be careful. Also, were those waves? We're getting a lot of shines here, aren't we? A lot more than we need, anyway. Whoa. <laughs> Tries to jump backward, but nope. <laughs> uh, let's get Bobbery back out here. Bobbery's fun. Yeah, Bobbery's definitely doing five damage to the uh, to the embers. Also, we should level up in this fight, unless there's one. Nope. Okay. So I'm just gonna keep this in. Uh, what do I? I you know I haven't even. Did I say I want to put? Yeah, I said I wanted to put BP up, didn't I? So we can get some of our badges back. I, I think I did anyway. Uh, but yeah. Um, these guys are really easy because we can just one-shot them with Power Plus and, and the, the ice thing. Kaboom, baby! Are you gonna use it? Ow! That's like a vampire attack, but luckily we're going to level up here, so I don't care. Hooray! Okay, so we have 30 of each of those already, yeah. Okay. So let's go for more BP. Um, let's see what badges... I'm thinking about putting... We have a lot of money, wow. I'm thinking of putting... Putting? Uh, putting... Spike shield? Do I, do I need spike shield right now? Not in this dungeon, but... Um, hmm. Yeah, I don't need the pity. <laughs> uh, I have another power plus, though. I can Totally do that. Oh, uh, what could I take off for power plus? Take off damage. damage. Take off quake hammer. Do I even need quake hammer in this dungeon? No, I don't. I could take off quake hammer, and I could take off close call. Let's take this off too. <laughs> um. Do I want close call or last standoff? I have... I have pretty lucky on already. So let's... Let's take off close call and quake hammer and put... Uh, put... Uh, you can also put defend plus on, which actually is a very good badge as well, but... Uh, I've never actually put on two power plus badges. Uh, this is not probably what we discussed 
uh, when I was talking about what I what I wanted, but um, I think you need to no, just blow it up. But yeah, I I kind of want to see what life is like with two power plus badges. Like like I said, I've I've never actually done this before, so oh yeah, I want to see something after this. First of all. <laughs> Yeah, so defense, most of the enemy's defense in the game now is just completely and utterly pointless. Like, we just do regular damage. <laughs> uh, it's beautiful. Uh, let's see if I can just roll my way up to the bills. Nope. I cannot. I think it's not worth it to spend the time cutting these battles out. <laughs> Let's just, let's just get right up to them so that we can, uh, fight. Um, let's try this out. So you guys have two defense, right? Excuse me, sir. Yeah, you, you scream and cry. Whatever. <laughs> Beautiful. How much will this do? Two. Okay. They have three defense then, right? Or two? I don't know. That's annoying. I hate having to make long jumps like that because it, it usually screws with the timing. Oh, well, okay, I didn't need that, but thank you. Yeah, bring those five extra people into the theater. Oh yeah! Bobbery, I don't think, yeah, can't. Can only do that on ground based enemies, so you can defend. I'm thinking defend plus might actually be a good idea over the power plus, but, um, I don't know. <laughs> actually, at least do it for this chapter. Oh, come on! Right. Uh. Can. Can Boko one shot them? Yes, he can. I didn't. I didn't even think of that, honestly. That's beautiful. <laughs> All right, moving onward. Uh, let's get Bobbery out here so I can just blow everything up. <laughs> this is gonna be terrible. <laughs> oh, oh, this is gonna hurt so much. Oh, that was terrible. That was such a bad idea. <laughs> oh, but it's so fun. It's so fun. Uh, I'm sorry. I shouldn't be having that much fun with, with getting hurt, but, you know, a little bit of masochism isn't bad for you, right? Also, that was a one-way trip. Uh-oh. Hey, it's a broken ship. Hello. Oh, no. Get the P down D up badge. York! Oh, sweet, sweet salvation! I thought no one would ever come, I had given up! What's that? Spare you the prologue and just curse you already? Now, how did you know I was gonna do that? No, seriously, hang on a sec. Can't you just listen to my spiel for a little bit? Yeah, he's. Come on. I've been locked here forever, board stiff, doing nothing but practice this speech. I like the fact that after three chests, Mario's like, yeah, 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 we get it already. You're gonna curse me, you're gonna get a thing. Just, let's, let's just get on with it. <laughs> huh? I'm already the fourth cursing chest you met? Are you serious? So, uh, you're saying you know exactly how this is all gonna turn out? Man, talk about a raw deal. You're a twisted little guy, you know that? I enjoy being cursed. Okay, fine, 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 fine! I get the picture, okay? Sheesh, all I wanted to do was see the face of some unlucky soul when I popped out. Is that so much to ask? No. Anyway, what are you waiting for? Just open already. You know what the key looks like, Mr. Cena already? Some ghost here has it. 
So just beat him, get it, and we'll get this farce over with. Come on now, I'm wait. I'm waiting. That's convenient. All right. And there we go. What could it be for? Yeah, yeah. whoop de doo You got the key. Party time. Let me out already. All right. Here we go. Since you're just itching to get this over with. Ahem. <clears throat> <laughs> Fools! You dopes fell right into my absolutely brilliant trap, and now you will suffer! Oh yeah, I'm so evil, bathing in the foul awful- Wait, what was next? Oh yeah, <clears throat> You fools have been cursed forever for your appalling stupidity! You will rue the day you open this chest of doom! Now, you wretched guy. Be cursed. <laughs> now you're cursed, but good. Suffer, suffer, suffer! Wait, that's maybe too much. Are you alright? That didn't really hurt, did it? <laughs> good, squirm and suffer like socially awkward worms. Big mood. From now on, in certain places, if you press Y, you'll turn into a pepper boat. Isn't that just gruesome? Just try it out so I can see the depth of your humiliation. Feel the terror of your feet. When you stand on one of the boat panels, the panel will feel your curse and glow. You stand here, slime. Feel the pain and press Y. Become a paper boat. That's cool. I like that animation a lot. It's like origami. <laughs> oh yes, such suffering. Do you feel the heart? Now you're a piddly little boat. We. <laughs> you float on the water. People will laugh at you. You'll be spit upon. But it only works in certain places. So don't worry. It's not too bad. When you want to return to normal, approach the panel and press Y. Now try it, worm! Yes, your pain is like a tasty banquet to me. Now do you understand your doom? Yeah, I get it. Then off with you, you jaded, cursed boat guy! Oh, and hey, listen, thanks for letting me do my thing. I feel better. <laughs> Unfortunately, that's the last cursed chest we get in the game. Oh, well, I say, that cursed chap seems rather a bit of alright, eh? Yeah. It wasn't too bad. Uh, there's nothing else in here, right? No. Okay. Got the P down D up badge, though. So, now that we have been cursed, we can. Oops, sorry, Bobbery. We can go on the water! Uh, the only thing we can do in this room is just get ourselves back, but we can now explore. Sorry. We can, <laughs> can now explore, uh,. Uh, a great deal of the rest of the dungeon and uh, go back to a few places and you know get just get things and stuff and items hooray starting with ow. Uh, I don't think I don't think that we can do anything and I don't think like we can go through that at all yet. Uh, let's. <laughs> right. Yeah. So those waves there will come into play soonish. Uh, so the first place that we want to go is actually back up this way. Because there was a boat panel here and also water! And it's also an area that's otherwise completely useless to us now. Let's get on here, become boat, and is there something we can do with that? Uh, I don't think so. I think we'll just go here. And go back out this way. Any any time you see like one of these little interconnecting. Uh, canals, uh, make sure you go in. So this boat feature is essentially uh, the game's workaround since there's no sushi character. 
But here we get the Defend Plus P badge, which is actually really good if you're planning on using characters like Boko, who have a very small amount of HP. Uh, I don't remember if we can fall down the waterfall. I think we can, right? Yeah, that's neat. Unfortunately, we can't go further over there because we, we can't go up the water. No, of course not. Uh, yeah, we can't go further over there because there is that gate in the way, but we can go this way. All the way this way, in fact. Uh, if you remember, this is like the first room we were in. At, uh, or second room, anyway. Yeah, this room had, like, all the spikes and stuff, and it had... The gate handle! But where does the gate handle lead? Find out in the next episode. Thank you all very much for watching. This has been Sephiroth Total 4 with Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.